hexaligon cobalt 3 plus is red in color whereas hexaligon l prime cobalt 3 plus is green l and l prime respectively corresponds to the options are shown here the options are the combination of amine aqua and 110 phenethrolate according to the spectrochemical series 110 phenethrolene is the strongest li ligon, then amine is the strongest ligon, then aqua. But 110 phenethrolene is the bidentate ligon. Here, L and L primes are monodentate ligon, so we neglect 110 phenethrolene from the options. Actually, the color seen is the complementary color of that of the wavelength absorbed predict which possible colors and their corresponding wavelengths are observed, the spectrochemical series can be used. The L prime that is second ligand is a green in color. The first ligand L is the red in color. Its complementary color is green. Here the complementary color is red. Green has the higher energy than red. Actually, low spin ligands induce the absorption of shorter wavelength, that is, higher energy. Cobalt exists as D6 configuration. The electrons of D6 orbitals are split into T2G and EG orbitals in the presence of strong field ligands. It has higher CFRC values, so the electrons are occupied in T2G orbital itself. Because of this high energy, it absorbs green wavelength and it goes electrons from T2G orbital to EG orbital. But high spin ligands that is weak field ligands induce the absorption of longer wavelength that is lower energy in the presence of weak field ligands the t2g and eg orbital will have lower cfsc values so it has lower energy the electrons are occupied according to off power principle it absorbs red wavelength and the electrons goes from T2G orbital to EG orbital. Because of high energy, it's supposed to have strong field ligands. Here the strong field ligands among aqua and amine are amine. Weak field ligand is aqua. So the L supposed to be amine and the L prime supposed to be aqua. The correct option is the amine and the aqua. Thank you.